Welcome back to my semi-new cooking show. My name is Romeo and today um, I'm going to be making vegan chickpea coconut rice. And I got this recipe off of Will Young on YouTube. You should check him out. He has a lot of like nice uh, ve easy like vegan recipes and stuff. So for now, I'm going to start off with uh, making the coconut rice and I'm going to do... It says like one cup of coconut milk, but I'm gonna double it, so we do two cups of coconut milk, and then we're gonna be using basmati rice. <laughs> so before you cook the rice, you wanna rinse it out with some water to get rid of like excess starch. I'm gonna toast the rice on medium high heat. Got some coconut milk. So there's like two cups of coconut milk, two cups of rice. Just want to stir. And once it's, make sure there's nothing sticking to the bottom. Cover and let it cook for 15 minutes. <laughs> so the coconut rice is on the stove and it's covered on medium heat, and we're gonna let it cook for 15 minutes. And then once that's done, I'm going to turn it off and let it cool for like 10 minutes. So right now, I'm going to prepare the ingredients for the chickpea. So the recipe says to add um, ha hazelnuts, but I'm also going to add some cashews because that's what I used last time. And I just, I just fucking love cashews. <laughs> just want to chop this up. So yeah, the first time I made this, um, I was like, shit, I forgot to get hazelnuts because that's what the recipe called for, but I had cashews at home so I ended up just using that. But it tasted really good still. Plus I just I like cashews. It tastes so fucking good. So right now I'm just like chopping up the nuts. <laughs> These nuts <laughs> Speaking of cut, um my sister Donna just cut my hair last week. Shout out shout out to Studio D hair salon in Vancouver. Frayers are 43rd. That's where my tattoo sh shop used to be, too. In the back. Yeah. Oh. This is gonna be crunchy. Fuck yeah. Race is looking nice. So we chopped it up, coarse, coarsely. <laughs> so we're gonna put these uh, nuts aside into a bowl, and then I'm gonna chop the the red onion. It's like spilling everywhere. Fuck. Next, we're gonna open up a can of whoop ass. Well, chickpeas. <laughs> now we're chopping up some of the broccolini. It says to use a cup, but I'm gonna use more than that. So we're doing double the amount. Broccolini. Heat up a pan. Put a tablespoon. Coconut oil. Let's add the red onion to the coconut oil. And the chickpeas. Yeah! So after you add in the red onion and the chickpeas into the coconut oil, um, we're gonna add in some turmeric powder. That'll give it like a nice color and flavor. Next, add some salt. <laughs> salt bay. <laughs> add broccolini. So it's that garlic powder, but I don't have any. But I do have these like garlic chips. 
So I'm just going to put some of that in here. <laughs> Garlic bake. <laughs> It also says to add um, chili powder and paprika, but I'm going to omit this, omit, uh, omit those out of this batch here because the person I'm cooking for is allergic to that stuff, so I'm just going to freestyle and do some substitute. And we're just going to saute that for like three to four minutes. Ah, I can tell it's going to be so fucking crunchy. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna add the hazelnuts and cashews. Now we're gonna add uh, unsweetened fine shredded coconut. And it says to use half a cup, but I'm gonna use like all of this, which is probably probably like yeah, a cup. Let it snow. Let it snow. <laughs> yeah. that color from the turmeric. Now that everything is cooked, I'm going to start plating it. So I'm going to start off with the coconut lace. Um, the rice is in the bowl. I'm going to start uh, plating it with the actual coconut chickpea. And so like I said earlier, I doubled up on the recipe. And the reason behind that is because I like leftovers, so <laughs> we eat some tomorrow, pack it up, so we'll start putting some on the rice. I'm just going to chop up some cilantro for a garnish. in the bowl. You can add some cilantro for a garnish. So we're gonna garnish it with some cilantro. <laughs> cilantro bay. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, so uh, there's cilantro on this one, but uh, 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 after I tried to cilantro bay, this is <laughs> fail. <laughs> you should just put it on here nicely. <laughs> And there we have it. This is a coconut. Oh shit! <laughs> coconut chickpea rice or chickpea coconut rice. Fuck, I don't know. It's what it is. <laughs> the nice thing about this dish is that it's uh, vegan and it's gluten free, um, and it's it's really good. <laughs> so yeah, if you want to try it? I recommend trying the recipe and eating it. Because <laughs> that's what you do, I guess, when you cook food, you eat it after. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you again for joining me. I don't know, maybe next time I'll actually be naked. Oh, 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 I'm stuck. <laughs> um, yeah, if you want to see the full-on nudity to join my OnlyFans, that does not exist. So, good luck with that. <laughs>